so how to update menlock for your drivers so we are going to see today how to update menlock format for HP so this is the red hat 7 and we are going to install the new updated HP menlock drivers module so let's begin so I have already downloaded from Melnox firmware site and share it in, with the description. So these are the three files the TGZ and the signature file is there. So it will be available in the site. Whenever you download, you will get this file. Now I am checking the integrity. This is the integrity of uh, the file which is uh, gpg hyphen hyphen import this is the public key hp enterprise config rsa integrity now i am checking the signature whether it is uh, ok with the current uh, hardware so this is the signature and the original tar file this is to check the integrity means linux linux integrity sign to the linux node reachable from the switch so you, you can see here gpg is good signature from hp enterprise company this is required whenever you need to install any drivers and if it is not there, you will not uh, see this uh, signature verified. So I am looking for LSPCI which is the Melanox. And this is the MP27500. And we check whether this network controller is there so to check the network controller So this is Melanox adapter which is uh, present 04000 InfiniBand controller and it should be available with the Connect X3 Pro. So LSPCA hyphen VB triple VS and the controller over here you can see 04 and I'm looking for the family vital product data. Uh, these instructions are also given on the site HP. So uh, this part number we have we got. This part number is very essential because it should match the driver. If it is not matching, then again you you are not able to install the driver. Now uh, we can run the quick query for checking uh, the drivers with this LSPCM and uh, this part like 0407 it is uh, different for different drivers so you can get it from the Melnox itself so uh, I am untaring this tgz file I already entered and these two files like fwconnect x3 pro this one file I will get from there see uh, these two files are extracted over here fwconnect x3 pro 
well and the pdf file you can look at the pdf or else you can go ahead the same instructions were given in the pdf also now this image should be installed now so this is a mst flint hyphen d and i'll check whether the bin directory is burning or not so just enter burn this will install you can see current version of flash and new version of LW you can see so it will update to 2.42.5056 and it's ok to go So HCA card should have that uh, drive. Yeah. How to Then this is type Q. And we need to reboot. 